go, but thankfully he's out there on the pitch and we are ready to go at the EBB or also known as the Ebb Stadium. Now what a shot looking to uh, spread the play over to this right hand side perhaps. No, they're going to continue down the left. Ball inside looking for Campbell breaking in the into area. Pass Marshall. Ball is cut across over the crossbar and it'll be a corner, an early corner for Aldershot here. They'll, they'll Pendlebury's corner going towards the near post. So it's a flick on, it's into the back of the net and Aldershot have taken the lead here through Joe Partington, the Aldershot captain. Donnellan, Donnellan threads the ball to McGaffney, who's looking to venture into the 18-yard box. Sliding challenge came in, though, and the ball will fall loose to Mark Holstead, midway inside his own half. Holstead clearing long, trying to get the ball forward into the path of Jarvis, who wins his header. Fad Hunty might make something, it flicks the ball into the path of Lapsley inside the penalty. Yeah. Oh, and it's just in front of Lewis Collins. Collins, though, keeps hold of possession and plays it to Donnellan. McGavin outside the uh, penalty area there. McGavin to Lapsley inside. McGavin receives the ball back, and McGavin has equalised for Torquay United. What a wonderful move that was. Fad Hunty keeps it in play by the corner flag, that's back with Wyatt, Wyatt running towards the penalty area, playing the ball into the penalty area, straight to an old shot uh, head, stoop down to the older shot defender to clear, Tavon Campbell has had to come very deep here to win the ball back in his own half and talking out of picking it up and might be creating a chance of their own here, Evans just behind Lewis Collins but it might fall to Aaron Jarvis in the penalty area, tries the shot to the near post, palmed behind by Ashby Hammond. Now it's out with uh, Tyler Frost on this right hand side as uh, Aldershot there looking to build an attack again and Pendlebury's onside plays the ball into Roberts in the penalty area Laps has come with a challenge but Bounce comes kindly back to him thankfully the toe poke there from Roberts goes straight through to Mark Hulsford just a little bit of a warning there Holstead's clearance goes up towards Lewis Collins Collins can't win his header but uh, Father Hunsey is making life difficult there for the number 29 Morgan Roberts is back defending now Campbell up against Marshall. Campbell looking to break into the penalty. Campbell within shooting range tries a shot and it's just wide of Mark Holstead's outstretched hand for a moment there. I thought it was going to just sneak inside the near post. Left of centre, midway inside the Torquay United half. Going into the box now towards the rising heads and it's actually the number 16 there, Corey Jordan that came up with the header. Straight into the palms of uh, Mark Holstead but... Uh, Old Shop takes some comfort from that. Can Talk United sneak their noses in front just before the interval? Long throw goes into the box towards Marshall, cleared away by Aldershot. Referee hasn't blown yet. Will do soon, though. Will do now. And that is that for the first half. And uh, well, we are back underway. Talk United kick off through Tom Lapsley. It's a long ball forward by Ross Marshall. It goes deep into. Old shot territory, well defended by Old shot on that occasion. It's breaking out now to the left hand side. Donnellan wins the ball back though. Outwitz Glover with the ball over the top. Collins now going central. Collins to McGavin, who we just mentioned. Can't trap the ball though. Left hand side looking to try and uh, make progress for Torquay. He's found his uh, path blocked though by Morgan Roberts. And now Pendlebury central. Looking to try a shot from distance. Brilliantly saved by Mark Holstead. Wonderful save by Mark Holstead. And Malisol centrally though, evades the challenge of Lapsley and plays Frost into play. Chance here for Old Shot to punish him. And Malisol makes a great save. And the rebound is superbly saved by Mark Holstead. Bringing the ball forward. Donnellan though will uh, block his route there. But it's a decent ball over to Frost on the right hand side if he can keep it in play. He has. Frost now to Amalazor, the substitute. Amalazor, Justin Amalazor. Up against Kieran Evans. Nice trickery. Chance here for Frost. Hacked away. Almost out of the hands from Ross Marshall. I think Holster would have got there, but Ross Marshall took no chances at all. Into the box it goes, towards the near post. Partington wins his header. Cordner clears. Sorry, Cordner tries to get to the ball, but it's Hansen who clears. Sent back in there. Important header by Marshall. Sent back in towards Cordner again. Partington the wins his header and United scuff clearance by Collins there. Glover trying to break into the box, has some support in the shape of uh, his teammates. Corden now on the edge of the box. McCoy there in a little bit of space on that left hand side and it's now found to McCoy. McCoy going centrally to Glover. United back in numbers though. Ocheng might fancy his chances from distance, tries to hook the ball into the box. Flag goes up for offside and the danger is averted. But United just looking a little bit panicky for a moment there. 
and play goes on. Hansen, Lewis Collins, just edging towards the 18-yard box, but loses possession. And now Amalazor beats the dead Dawson, spreads the ball to Frost. Frost making some progress down the right-hand side, looking to break into the parent here. Frost might try a shot here, goes back to Partington. Someone's going to surely have a go in a moment. Amalazor tries a shot and it's over the bar. Goes to Corey Jordan, though. Now the ball is headed up into the direction of Ben Wyatt, but it's Amalazor comes away with it. Now he's up against Wyatt, going central. Fadahunty coming back to try and win the ball back for his side. Important interception by Ryan Hansen. And now Lewis Collins on the right-hand side plays the ball forward, but Fadahunty is looking a little bit leggy for the first time in the game there, chasing after that ball. Collins goes up for the header, misses out to Glover. Donovan in support. Again, Fadahunty just not quite sharp enough to just pick up on the loose ball there. And now Hutchison brings the ball forward for Aldershot, out onto that uh, right-hand side. Breaking into the box, tries to shot, another excellent save by Mark Holstead, this time denying Tyler Frost, and Nico Lawrence clears. Ocheng now. Ball going into the box again, falling towards Hutchison, it's going over his head. Certainly a different game to the one at Plainmore earlier in the season. <laughs> Holstead <laughs> clears his lines, referee waves play on, only for a few moments longer, and that is that. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.